It's Billy's Vlogs. Good morning, good morning guys. Today is, let me just check, Monday the 7th of January. I am all ready to go to college now. First day back to college. First day of the weekly. Sorry, now the light is going to get really bad because it's quite dark because it's a dirty, dirty day today. Um, it is raining, so I'm hence me with the rain jacket. So I better go because I'm gonna meet mum down at the park. She's brought Gigi for a quick walk because she's dying to go for a walk. She hasn't been for a walk in a few days. So that's what I'm gonna do. It's currently five past nine. I have 25 minutes to get down. So it takes me about five minutes to cycle. So yeah, okay. I will talk to you guys later. Teeth look pure white, yay. So I'm back home now in college. I had my lunch. Must be home a good hour. Anyways, if not more, took the Christmas tree down. It's gone. Um, I'm just doing the fire there. But we're going to take a trip up to Archer's to see. She wants to look at the rugs. Oh, why do I look so pale? I need the sunlight again. I still love That's this one, but the price of it, like 255 euro. <laughs> Look, purple one. I don't like the feeling of it. It feels really rough or something. Yeah. That one's nice. Like this. Tell me, That's yeah, the, the one behind it is nice too. Oh yeah, that one. That's lovely. Nice, uh, that one's nice. That's the same design as the orangey one. It's lovely. But it's not as colourful. It looks pure grey in the camera. It's brown, actually. No, I don't like that one. Oh, that's the smaller one there. Yeah, that'd be too small, though. Oh, yeah. That's huge, isn't it? It's massive. It's very thin. Oh, 276. <laughs> <laughs> That's very dark. I like the feeling of that, but it's quite dark. Did you check the price on this one? 65, 64.99. 20% mm. off on furniture. It's lovely. Really like that. Yeah, if you're in the hall, oh, check out my outfit of the day. And then you could put your little coats up there. Oh. Keys. <laughs> your shoes and the drawers. Mum was trying to get a bargain. Yeah, I was kind of glancing. They have this one. Is this gold? Is it too big? This? Mm. Is that gold? Or is it beige? It's goldy. Goldy on. <laughs> this one's kind of gold too, it's but it's a darker gold, yeah. yeah I'm telling you, buy two, two yeah. ones of the colour you like. I need it. If you buy two shades, of a colour that you like. But I like that colour shade, don't I? See, it's like that, isn't it? Yeah, kind of quilted. That's quite big though. Pink, yellow. So on David Mitchell's team tonight. Okay guys, um, it's been a while since I vlogged today, but um, the grey 
rug is now in my room and the collardy kind of rug we got is in the sitting room um that's all we got when we were away up at archers now i was planning on doing this today but it's apparently 10 past nine at night so can i turn on the light and show you properly sorry about the boob yeah but that's all our crimbo stuff so all of that has to be put away so i want to get the energy and motivation and all that jazz to do that tomorrow because i'm going to um i think it's boxer size class tomorrow with my cousin edwina so i'm looking forward to doing that so that is on later on I need to pull this from around my ears because it's annoying me. But that's on later on in the evening. So when I come back from college, um, if Mama is here, then I can we can put the stuff up to the attic. If not, it'll probably be Wednesday or Thursday. If I'm sore on Wednesday, then I'm sure I'll be sore on Thursday as well. So it probably won't get done till maybe the weekend, what we see. Hopefully get it done tomorrow fingers crossed right so i'm gonna leave it at that for today because i need to brush my teeth get my jammies on get my outfit ready for tomorrow for college and roll rollies for mum and i for tomorrow as well so long list of things and it's currently 10 past nine at night and i'm full of energy so this is not going to be good for my sleep pattern tonight See you tomorrow. Bye. Morning, guys. Um, it's twenty past eight on Tuesday, the eighth of the. <laughs> so the eighth of December. That's how tired I am. The eighth of January. <clears throat> I need to wake up properly. Big time. So tired. Okay, guys. I'm off to college right now. Um, it is going on nearly 10 past 9, so I better go. Good bye. I've literally been home about over an hour now. It is 10 past 3, and I had my lunch. I've been watching a bit of YouTube from my phone, and I'm going to go down with Mum. She's going to be looking after my uncle's two kids for a while. Um, so I said I'd go down with her. So... That's what I'm going to do now. I feel awful cold all of a sudden. So I'm putting my shoes back on. I really need to sort out my school bag also. I'm saying school bag, college bag. I need to sort out my um, business calculations folder that like really needs to be done. Nothing was done in the hallway. The Christmas decorations are still there. Reason being is because I had no one to hold the ladder for me. Mum was out having coffee with her friend, so I had no one to hold the ladder for me while I was going to the attic. So that's not done right now. We may get done this evening, not sure. I'm still not sure, actually. I was sure this morning that I was going to the boxer size class, but now I'm unsure of what to do. I think some bus is on at 7. I might ring up the place that it usually is on and I might ring them and ask them is it on tonight if so I'd prefer to go to Zumba is Zumba on tonight and that usually starts at 7 and it's on from 7 till 8 so it's an hour and it's the same price I think it's 6 or 7 euros so we'll see what happens in the exercise area but I did cycle to and from college today and yesterday so that's about it for now with the information that I have and I better go because mum will be here soon and I need to put my other maths folder or business calc folder into my bag to sort it out. <laughs> Tom turned into pink. Did Okay, it's seven o'clock. I found out the Zumba wasn't on. Um 
If you're wondering what that last clip was, it's just that Josh had my camera for literally a few seconds. So, anyways, it's 7 o'clock. There's no Zumba this week. I've decided not to do box exercise. And you're probably looking at me, oh, Billy, pure lazy, pure, won't even do a bit of exercise, pure fat. Uh. No, that's not the reason why. The reason I didn't want to go to box exercise was because I didn't want to go to an exercise class and for me to immediately feel sore. And I know that's what's going to happen, but I found when I started like going every day to course cycling and going to Zumba, I found it was a lot easier to do it that way because there's like stretches and warm ups. And I know most exercise classes do that, and that box exercise probably will do that. But I want to start off with something I know and I know that I love because I don't want to go into something thinking oh my god I'm pure sore if I do this again now I'm going to I don't want to do it that's just my mind frame right now and that's just today so that was my decision to make today um so next week I think somebody's going starting up I'm going to ring them on Monday of next week and hopefully I can start on Tuesday and maybe even Thursday we'll see how much money I've left at the end of this week when I sort out all my bills and stuff anyways I've been to deals I needed to get a protractor for mats as I had said so I had asked mum would she get me one fortunately enough unfortunately enough she didn't know what a protractor was well I didn't ask her particularly to get me a protractor, I asked her to get me a mat set and she thought I needed a compass, but actually I needed a protractor. But anyways, I stopped into deals myself and got picked up 16 euros, 90 cent worth of stuff. You're probably wondering, Billy, why? Um, I don't know. It's just what I did because I had it this week. Anyways, first thing I picked up was these. And I was thinking I wanted to get these today. These are sticky notes and they're all different shapes and sizes. So I wanted to get those for anything really. So like if I wanted to clean out my press or something. I just take a sticky note out and remember clean your press. Kind of stuff like that. Or revise for this exam or organise this folder. By the way I organised my maths folder. It is just, just done now and it's full to the brim because I have two mats folders one from previous stuff that we've already done and the one that that I bring to class with me because it's way too heavy to carry around I also picked up a new um, upside down a A4 refill pad I have one of these for my um, my accounting technician site so for my accounts tax and I use them all you can rip the pages out and staple them to whatever you need so that's why I got this these ones because you can rip the pages out so this one is for mats for when I run out my other one sorry about the bad angle it's just that I have it have I'm holding it with my hand not a tripod I also picked up this new little pencil case um because I had this makeup bag and it's full and I want to have a smaller one so it's not as full and I picked up one of the, these pens which saves a lot of room because it has blue, black, um, red and green so that saves me having four pens I have one I also just checking did I take anything else out of the bag don't think I did no I also picked up this little thing, this is revision cards. Now, there's nothing inside, obviously, but there's, well, there is, there's cards, but I mean, there's no writing on them. But they're all little, um, little cards that's inside that I can write stuff on for revision. And I was looking at this the other day when I was getting my other things last week, um, Friday, I think it was, and I was deciding whether or not to pick one of those one of these up and I said no Billy you know today you might as well just treat yourself and get one because you will need one it was the last one so I was lucky yeah so I picked that up I also picked up some thumbtacks I don't know when I'll ever need these but you know they come in handy thumbtacks you know like 
these things you do need around so I also picked up these colour these sticky notes these um do you know the luminous yellow luminous pink luminous orange and luminous green <laughs> I picked those up sticky notes um let me see I do pick up another few things oh rubber bands rubber bands need of them big time you can never go around with rubber bands so they were I think this is the only choice they had so I just went with the white ones because I usually like the original brown looking ones I don't know why it's just the thing so I got these white ones and I think these are the last two things oh no three I picked up a print stick as I call it even though print stick is the brand so it's a glue stick basically um and I didn't notice but this is Hotel Transylvania um characters on the front which is fine so I picked up one of them because you can never go around with them either and I also picked up this these are bits and pieces <laughs> are they paper stamp I don't know what to call these but I was like oh I forgot to get paper clips no worries I'll get them the next day yeah so because I need to get another folder so and if you're wondering why I didn't pick up a folder today it was because they didn't have the ones that you put your own poly pockets in yourself today so yeah um I got these these kind of hold like a few sheets together or whatever and I like that they were rose gold and in a jar and an actual glass jar with the cork kind of like a wine wine cork I don't know what to call that I'm a bit confused right now because I'm trying to think and last but certainly not least the thing that I actually went in to deals for geometry set the protractor oh this is he helix or helix you know the that's an actual good brand isn't it I don't know I've been out of school for so many years now that I don't know what's good well I know that the Bic the Bic is good for the pens and that's a Bic so this is the damage I did today with stuff and this clip has been going on for nearly eight minutes now so I'm gonna go organize this stuff I think that's everything yeah that's everything I also paid 40 cents for this bag so yeah T T Y to the L bye dinner is done mom had already put the ribs in and <coughs> what, the, what was that it was like a growl and the baby potatoes got some mushy peas it's my last few days of butter on my potatoes and mushy peas and my veggies I'll tell you why because I want to start Unislim on Thursday this week so even though I'm still eating healthy at home of my own I'm still having the luxury of putting extra butter on my toast or putting extra butter on my potatoes and stuff like that um, so it'll all be accounted for hopefully when I start Unislim on Thursday I really want to start and that's another reason why I didn't want to go to the exercise class tonight was because to join Unislim um, this month actually it, I think it's free the month of January um, so it's still 10 euro or yeah it's 10 euro per class so it would have been 10 euro for Unislim and then seven euro for a boxer size. So it was 20 euro gone already that I, and then I needed my stuff for college. So anyways, I'm gonna eat my dinner because I'm really hungry. So goodbye, love you. Mwah. She's been waiting for ages for me to pet her, but she's all wet from being outside. Yes, you are. Look at my socks and sandals this morning. Go and bring Jock in, okay? Because he's going to start barking. Come on.
Come on. Come in. Come on, Jack. Thank you very much. Hi guys, today is still Wednesday. This camera does not want to focus at all. I think it's time that I start saving and invest in a new camera. <laughs> it's fine when I'm doing sit down videos because like literally it's in one position and it's focused on my face the entire time. Anyways, I had uh, just one of those feelings of laziness today. So. I came back from college, I had my lunch and I felt really cold so I wrapped myself in a blanket and ended up falling asleep. Okay, I think that's better. Anyways, I ended up falling asleep for about an hour and a half maybe and then I just got up then. Anyways, um, it's not that I feel energised, I just got that little burst of energy so I am going to be doing a bit of maths. Our business calculations that we have did today that I was really confused on and I really need to revise back on the questions because we'll be doing them tomorrow correcting them um, I had to open my window a little bit because it's just I'm really warm now because I'm after doing the whole lot of the dishes I made my fruit salad for tomorrow as well tomorrow I'm going to be starting uni slim um, tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. so I'll be leaving earlier tomorrow morning I could leave around 10 to 9 get there for about 5 to um, and drop my bike over a course and then walk over or leave a quarter to leave my bike over and walk over so I kind of want to be the first second or third person there because the thing is if I have to start a membership and all that jazz do you know what I mean I don't want to be late for college either so I'd have about a half an hour or more to get myself in there, become a member and weigh in. So I don't know if I'll feel comfortable sharing with you my overall weight, but I will keep you updated like when I lose so much, um, I'll tell you how much I lost and every week or if I gain something every week, I'll make sure to tell you. Um, and also um, what I was at the beginning and then what I am then. If that makes like every maybe half a stone or a stone I will tell you what I was and then what I am because I don't want to be vulnerable and put myself out there and say this is what I weigh in for people to go oh my god that's quite heavy or she shouldn't be that weight you know because it is an insecurity of most people and I don't really want to share that and I hope you can understand that if you were put in that situation that maybe you wouldn't feel comfortable either so I'm just not going to do that but I will let you know like what I do lose now I did weigh myself on Monday of this week I don't know was it Monday or Sunday I think it was Monday morning or Sunday morning either or so I know what I was then and if I have lost anything between then and today I mean tomorrow then I will let you know um, but mum had taught me because she used to watch Uni Slim she taught me that don't be surprised if you weigh heavier on their weight scale because our weight scale is a bit iffy I think there's like two pounds or so in the difference I think you're two pounds lighter on ours and two pounds because it's all messed up so but I said at least I know what I am and I expect to be heavier than I won't feel too bad. I think this month, guys, I really need to look after myself. I've put on so much weight over the years, and I know I begin every year starting off with this, but this time I'm not doing it on my own. I'm actually going to a place I'm paying basically to lose weight. So if I mess up, then it's coming out of my own pocket. So I have to basically try my hardest. 
okay i'm going to try and do this math because i want to be finished everything by half nine because it's half eight now i need to have a shower and i've already got my clothes out for tomorrow so yeah and this has already been going on nearly five minutes <sighs> i rant too much at least this week's more talking than last week i reckon i'm going to have to have a shower in the morning I'm just gonna lower that down because i still have one two three four five six questions to do and actually eight because one of the questions have two little questions in them so i still have eight questions to do and it's 25 past nine and i don't really want to keep going now because i thought i'd have a shower because i really want to wash this can but if i don't have a shower tomorrow morning i'll have a shower tomorrow evening not that i'm dirty anyway so i'm not a clean person i'll give myself um i'll clean my face and and that in the morning <laughs> i don't want to wake up anymore now because i'm starting to feel nice and tired and if i know if i go for a shower i'll be full of, en full of energy and i still have to finish these questions i probably will get them done till about 10 o'clock because it took me an hour to do don't ask me how many questions, I'm not going counting back. I don't even know if they're right, but as long as I attempted them. So I'm gonna I'm actually gonna leave it at here for today because I've so much more to do on these questions. Um Yeah. So see you later. See you tomorrow. Bye. I should be ashamed of myself. Don't look at me. Look. Well, you can have a look if you want. Um, I'm just currently watching uh, Would I Like You, uh, streaming it from my phone. But today is Thursday. Um, I did not vlog this morning because, as I said yesterday, last night, I would have been leaving at quarter to nine. So I was in a bit of a rush this morning. I wasn't eating breakfast because I was getting weighed in so I don't know why everything just seemed to happen together so quickly maybe because the routine in the morning let the dogs out feed the dogs let the dogs in give the dogs water make the coffee daddy daddy doody da boo so all that anyways I started off last year the same weight that I am today so within the year I've gained the weight back on that I had lost of last year anyways that doesn't matter I'm still happy that to go on to move on and to get to my goal whatever my goal may be I don't have a set goal because I don't want to set myself up for disappointment at the moment um, so yeah today's Thursday as I had already said today's the 10th I don't know that I mentioned to you guys, I ordered a book from Amazon, it was called The Bone Clocks by David Mitchell and it had said that it hadn't been dispatched yesterday but it actually got delivered today. So I read about 16 pages of that book, it is really good so if, if I were to recommend you a book this year it would be The Bone Clocks by David Mitchell and I'll show you the front of the book just so you know what it looks like it's a good hefty book like so this is the book the bone clocks really good book this is the thickness there is no chapters in the book which really surprised me no you know when you start a book and you're like oh okay here i'm gonna stop at this chapter but they're not necessarily chapters they're kind of like dates and like this date here now i'm gonna go put into the books 29th and then after that was the 30th of december and then this is the 13th so they're not really chapters they're kind of like dates so i stopped on page 17 i was at the last part of page 17 which i will continue before i go to sleep tonight after my shower that i need um, it's 20 to 8, still need to get a melon for fruit salad tomorrow because 
As you know, Friday is the day that I venture to town to go to the bank to collect my money. And I think I'm getting my eyebrows done tomorrow as well. So, yeah, I'm going to definitely need my fruit salad before I go uptown. So I'm going to have a nice breakfast in the morning. I'm thinking because this Uniswim thing, guys, I'm sorry these clips are going on for ages, but this is the best that you'll get. And I'm thinking... Because Uniswim recommends that you only have seven eggs per week. And I don't know if you know me, but you know that I eat way more than seven eggs per week. I could go to say that I could have 10, 11, 12 eggs in a week. Um, but this week is starting from today. So, because today I started. So I've already had three because I made a big, huge omelette for my lunch. Um, so I've all, almost like half of my weekly limit but if I go on to the book because I left the book downstairs silly me but if I go down to the book and see like do you do you take up your do you like put they're called bites in Unislim so do you add a bite for every extra egg you have or I might ask that question next week and try to stick to the seven. It's just because there's so much protein, I suppose, in an egg. And if you're having so much egg and so much other protein in the day, probably not recommended. Anyways, I'm gonna go because this clip's five minutes long. And I am just doing these clips. I'm gonna go onto my computer when I'm editing. I'm gonna be like, oh, you only took about 10, 11 clips, Billy. Yeah, but they're all like five minutes, ten minutes long. Because <laughs> that's the way I am. A weirdo. Taking 20 minute clips. Mm -hmm. Can you see this right now? Can you see my face? I'm going to have to do the zoom um, and focus. Don't mind that. Let's just have to do that for my face. So you can see better here in the light. But my face. It's just like me just broke out, pro red. Now you can see it properly. See all here, it's all red. All here, it's all red. All down here, all here. And all across my other cheek. Now this probably won't focus, but I'll tell you. I'm gonna bring it back into the bedroom. Oh, that looks worse on camera. So, I did my usual routine in the shower washed my face with my um cleansing gel and i came out my face was dry so i put the toner on my face and i usually let the toner dry in because putting the moisturizer on after it it gets quite um just doesn't feel what great and whatever anyways let the toner dry in but as it was drying in it started feeling really my skin started feeling a bit stingy now it's not it doesn't feel hot to touch but it really feels hot on my skin and you're probably thinking billy why didn't you wash it off why do you look like an idiot right now i'll just give myself a bit of a poof <laughs> um the reason why i didn't wash it off is because i want to see how it reacts because i don't that is a really good product and you probably heard me talking about it before i don't know why it's reacting to my skin like this now um but it really feels so weird and it looks 20 times worse than camera. It doesn't look as bad in real life. Um, it looks worse than camera. It looks so red and blotchy. And just hope that I'm not allergic to it. I could be allergic. Unless like the past week or so that I haven't been using it. Um, like the toner. The, the gel was fine. It's just the toner. And that's what I used to put on when my makeup was on. As a base i'm not a base but i sometimes i use it as a base and then i use it after to help the makeup mesh together so i don't know what's going to happen after this hopefully my face cools down feels so hot do you know when you're on in a hot country and you're on the beach and your face gets slightly burnt or just overheat and oh, sorry about my bra 
<laughs> and that's what happens. This is what happened to me. That's what it feels like. Now it's starting to feel hot to touch. Yeah. It's as if my face got sunburned with no sun and just toner. Look, oh my god. So bad. Maybe they're my dry areas. Because this and the rest is the rest of my skin is oily areas. Oh man, look at that. I'm gonna go for now in case I pass out in front of the camera. Look at that. Good morning, guys. Today is Saturday. I didn't vlog anything yesterday, which was Friday. Um, bad angle. I really didn't do anything much yesterday. I went to college, obviously, and then I came home. Actually, I went to town, and then I came home. Boss, I got my eyebrows done yesterday. They're looking fresh. Yes, they are. Don't disagree with me. Am I joking? Anyways, um, there's not much on the rota today, or there's not much on the schedule. As today is Saturday, I finally finished the first week back of college, which was quite. It went quite fast, I think. Um went really fast so I think I want to tidy around my room because it's quite messy and I want to also have a shower moisturize all that jazz um this week or the past few days of going to Unislim um have been quite tough because I don't know I just because now I know that I can't just venture out and start this clip again because I'm out of focus that's better um yeah so I can't venture out and excuse me I didn't even burp I don't know why I said excuse me I was going to anyways I can't venture out and have sweets or anything like that now because I really 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 want to lose something at the end of this week which will be on Thursday when I go in and weigh in so and today's only Saturday, so I don't want to ruin anything. Yesterday for snacks, I had my fruit salad and I had a bit of um, a Ravita cracker with some peanut butter on. So, you know, I've been doing good, but it's really difficult. I'm not going to lie, it is quite difficult because as well as people think that there's addictions in the world, in the world, food is the biggest I feel food is the biggest addiction in the world like sugar and fat and all that it's really really addictive and it's hard not to venture out and eat like what you want to eat when you have a choice but you choose not to so it's quite difficult but I'm doing it for myself for my own health mentally and physically I think I might watch a movie today. I want to watch A Star Is Born again. So, I don't know. I just feel quite bored right now. But that's just Saturday for you. So I might pop on some music and tidy my room. Or I might just watch some videos on YouTube and tidy my room. So that's what I'm going to do now because I have the energy to do it. I'd love to do something. It's not ready to do. Just tidy my room. Because like, look at this mess. It's not messy, but I mean, it is messy. It's not dirty, it's messy. It needs to be done now. And it is Wednesday. There is Gigi. <laughs>
right guys i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up i know it was a bit slow this week as well as last week but i'm still trying to get over the whole thing of christmas and everything still but hopefully within the coming weeks everything will be great especially with my weight loss and stuff like that hopefully i lose weight and keep up on track with healthy eating another thing is as well i didn't go out last night so i'm super 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 proud of myself uh, if you're probably thinking like oh billy well not going out is very easy well when you're so used to going out and when all your friends are going out it's kind of hard so i stayed in this week because I want to get up on the scale on Thursday and have lost something. Um, and if I don't lose anything, I won't bl be able to blame the drink. So then I know how everything goes. Anyways, as I said at the beginning of the video, if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And if you're not allowed or if you're unable to subscribe, I totally understand. Don't forget that I love you. Don't forget to keep positive and I shall see you next week with another weekly vlog goodbye by the way today's sunday Mwah.